Alrighty guys, here's just a short video uh, of me cooking in this military kitchen trailer. Say hi Logan. Hi. As you've seen from my other trailer, it has four burners and yes, this is a different trailer than the other one. And then it's got two burners over here for the two ovens. I actually took the big pots out. I put took the pots out of these ovens and I put in the grates so that I can actually cook in them like a regular oven. And on the top, you got these warmers up here to keep the food warm. Um, and I have this nice big griddle. It's a pretty good size. I don't know, maybe three foot griddle or so. Here's one of the burners in action. You can see it down there. I got this little power supply off eBay to run it. So I can only run one at a time right now or I need to get multiple power supplies. I'll probably just build my own next time. It did come with a hole in it. When I took this all, when I opened it all up, <clears throat> some mice were in in it, so uh, they chewed holes in some of the stuff. But I have the other roof covering over that, so water doesn't really leak in there too bad. Um, does have the roof vents? I've got some of them open, which is nice. And then got all this cabinet storage down over here. Uh, I've got it all full of the uh, enclosure kit that's, that goes to this and all my s cooking utensils and stuff are down there, most of them. It has these in the oven when I picked it up, um, but like I said, I took those out and just put the grates in there to make it a regular oven. So I'm never going to cook in that, at least I don't think I will. Um, one thing that I have noticed with this thing, the water runs off it good, but... <laughs> When it runs down, it collects in these pouches down here at the bottom. And they fill up with water and it kind of sags the roof and the whole thing down. Uh, so that's a little annoying, but I guess it helps weigh it down so it doesn't flap if it's windy. But... Let's see. Excuse me. I'm going to give you a shot from this angle. Kind of see it a little better. But well, that's it guys, cooking up some hamburger patties with some potatoes, onions, uh, I've got some couple cubes of butter mixed in there with all of it, so it's going to be delicious. But alright, well, hope everyone has a good one. See you next time.